Well, good morning, everyone. Welcome to Wednesday in the Word. And once again, I'm glad you're with me this morning to dig into God's Word. I want to share a passage of Scripture with you that I absolutely love. It happens to be the last psalm in the Bible. I want to read to you Psalm 150. Listen to what God's Word says. Praise the Lord. Praise God in His sanctuary. Praise Him in His mighty heavens. Praise Him for His acts of power. Praise Him for His surpassing greatness. Praise Him with the sounding of the trumpet. Praise Him with the harp and the lyre. Praise Him with timbrel and dancing. Praise Him with the strings and pipe. Praise Him with the clash of cymbals. Praise Him with resounding cymbals. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I love this psalm. I find it very interesting that it is the last psalm in the book of Psalms, Psalm 150. And it's a song about praise. It's a song about praising God, praising God for who he is, uh, praising God for who he always has been, who he always will be. God is good and God loves us. And God, he's our father. He provides for us. He cares for us. He's done so much for us. He continues to do for us. And we get to praise him. And what I love about this psalm is that we can praise God with anything and everything that we have. I love the fact that it talks about praising him with the instruments, uh, the instruments of music. Uh, we can make joyful noises to the Lord. But what I love most of all is verse 6, where it says, Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. The best way that you and I can praise the Lord is with our tongues. It's with our lips. God gave us power in the tongue. He gave us power that can roll off of our lips. And he wants us to use this power to praise him, to glorify him, to honor him. And so what an awesome psalm. This week we're having VBS here at Start Baptist Church. And I've been hearing the kids sing. Uh, we've got some loud music, uh, but the kids have been singing. They've been raising their voices their praise uh, has been falling off of their lips for God, our good God, our Father who loves us. And so it just reminded me this week already that we should be praising God anywhere and everywhere with anything and everything we have. Uh, if God gives us instruments, we should use those instruments to give him praise. But God, he blessed us with a tongue. He blessed us with lips. He blessed us with this mouth. And we are to use it to bring him praise, to give him praise. And so I hope that you do that today. I'm going to try to do that today. And I hope we will do that each and every day with our lives. Give God praise. Bring him glory. Give him honor. He's worthy. I want to remind you that there are 153 days left until Christmas. That also reminds me I've got 103 days left until I run the New York City Marathon. Oh, God is good. I hope you have a great rest of your day. I hope you have a great rest of your week. And I do look forward to being with you next Wednesday, if it's the Lord's will.